Hey guys, happy Saturday to everyone. I wanted to do a changing video. I wanted to put the other outfit on little Miss Lucy here because while well, it's really nice out, the sun is out, there's some clouds in the sky, but we're in the 40s. Temperature wise, I couldn't be happier. <laughs> so I'm trying to make the most of this really nice weather and while it's got some light coming in the window, I figured I should just make a video. Since I'm gonna change her anyways, I'll just bring you guys along. But yes, I love this on her though. This is really super cuddly. Even if the feet are big, it's still very sweet on her. But um, I wanna try the other one on because I think that's gonna fit her better. The little two piece one, it's the same um, material or material same um pattern like it's got the little leggings but it's like a pink shirt and because even though it's nice out it's warmer like tremendously warmer than it's been and i can't even tell you how long i still it's definitely definitely not warm per se but i'm glad we see sunshine finally <laughs> after all the crazy weather we've had so i'm gonna leave her little T-shirt on. I love this T-shirt on her, by the way. This little onesie that has her name on it. Love, 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 love. And I put socks on with the other one just because the feet were so big in it. But the the other set that I've got, this is what I'm putting on her. It's got the same pattern, a little flowered pattern, but then with this little top. Um, but the feet look more appropriately sized in this. So I'm not sure whether they goofed on the size of the other one because the feet on that were just huge I'm thinking I might just take it and have it have it um, taken in because there's a seamstress right on the corner that we use um, so I figured that might be an option but either that or I just won't worry about it because you know like she was swaddled in her blanket after I put it on her anyways when it's cold I keep her swaddled all the time oh, get your little hands in there your little your little fingers I just love her. Um, I've had a really nice start to my day. Had my two workouts today. Um, oh, I like this. This button's down the whole back so you could actually just, instead of sliding it up over, you just put it on like this. It's kind of nice. Um, but I had my bar workout this morning and then my yoga workout after. And I haven't been able to really do that because I just haven't been feeling up to it the last couple of Saturdays so I was glad to get back to my normal routine and doing both classes today which felt really good um, I honestly think that the weather affects how I feel physically like when we've just had such cold weather it just hasn't been nice here for the last couple of weeks even though I want to pretend like it's nice I want you know <laughs> warm weather to arrive it just hasn't been so for me I think by this time of year, it's where I just start to feel ugh overall. Like my energy level isn't the greatest. Like it's just, I don't know. I think it just sucks the life out of me um, because of the long winter and the constant, you know, oh, we're going to get snow and then we're going to have a nor'easter. And it just, it brings my mood down. It just makes me not motivated, even though I'm generally a motivated person. And granted, I work out every day. There's not a day that I skip. But there are definitely days that I put more into it. And that's what I want to continue doing because I don't want to lose the progress that I've, you know, achieved. And it's very easy this time of year to just be like so ugh, about, you know, the weather and wanting to leave my house at night. <laughs> Things like that. And it definitely affects, you know, my fitness, all of it. So I'm really looking forward to having some warm weather sooner rather than later. I'm thinking that we're now on the upswing because the next week or so, the temperatures actually look like they're going to be going up overall. And that makes me a very happy person. <laughs> I won't lie. This is really sweet. See, this is how the other one should fit. Like if you look at the feet on this, they fit her appropriately. They might be just a hair big on the ends, but that you would expect that for, you know, a footed anything, even if it's a newborn size or whatever. But these fit her like a glove. These look really nice on her. This is a very sweet outfit. I like this. 
Very cute. You just keep turning your head. I don't know what you're looking for over there, but you're always looking over here. She's so cute. She always turns her head this way as I'm maneuvering, maneuvering her around. Her head turns the other way, but it's for some reason it just tends to always turn towards me, which is kind of sweet. <laughs> I won't lie. If I were, if she were a real baby, that would be like really lovely, knowing she's looking, looking for mommy. <laughs> I'm gonna leave her headband on. I love the headband. It really matches the colors and the whole theme of, you know, pretty, you know, pink flowers and such all over it. But, oh, I love this. This is so cuddly looking on her, too. See? The feet fit much better. This is a much nicer fit. So let's sit up and show everybody how you look. I probably could take her t-shirt on. You can slightly see it underneath, but I don't really care. I don't really mind. But look at how sweet, you guys. Isn't she just the cutest little thing? I love her so much, you guys. And she's just, the reason why I try to prop her up and hold on to her is because she's soft enough where she just wants to fall the way over. So I'm always trying to like prop her up so she doesn't look like she's bending in half because her silicone is so soft. But you'd have to kind of help hold up a newborn anyways. Look at her, she's just the sweetest. I love these squishy cheeks. But yeah, this fits her so much nicer than the other outfit. I love it on her. You guys know how I am about pinks and stuff. And this is no exception. And it fits her really, really nicely. So I'm pleased with that. So that will be her outfit of the day. And this headband, really, I love. It's delicate. It's so cute. I might have to get more from this seller. She has like a whole bunch all different kinds and based on like what I'm getting her for summer I may just order some matching headbands or like accenting headbands for her different outfits um I'll just kind of play it by ear I think but yeah she's just I'll probably re-swaddle her and I'll probably hold her and carry her around with me or just give her some cuddles or whatever um this afternoon just because I've got the house to myself my other half is traveling with the hockey team. They're in like the final tournament of the, I think it's state, it's not a state tournament, it's actually national. Um, so he's actually, I believe he's in Boston. Yeah, he's in Boston today with them. So th they're having a tournament, so it's been quite peaceful here. And I'm just gonna soak up every moment I have with this sweet baby girl since I am home alone and I can do that and just enjoy the fact that it's not frigid weather outside. <laughs> but I hope everybody's enjoying their Saturday. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing Lucy in her little outfit. It's very sweet, I'm very pleased with it. And once again, I do have more packages coming. I have more outfits coming for both Lucy and the new baby. I haven't heard any updates on my new baby. I'm generally not one to bother the artist, though. Um, my guess is she's a missed creating and making and, you know, all of that. So I'm really excited to still be getting her. Um, but I just have to be patient. And my birthday is actually... Um, is on the 3rd of April. So I'm kind of thinking of her, that baby being like my birthday gift to myself. <laughs> you know, even though I paid for her, you know, in February or the end of February or whatever. Um, yeah, I'm going to consider that to be like my birthday gift to myself. <laughs> I'm of the mindset that I should be able to celebrate my birthday all month, but uh, my family just doesn't let me get away with that um, because my... Both my daughter's birthdays are also in April, and so is my other half. So we're all April babies in this household, which should tell you we're a whole bunch of strong personalities because we're all Aries. But um, yeah, I'm glad because I've got all my shopping done for them. I have their presents, and they're they're all done, so I don't have to worry about it. But then I'm hoping it'll be, make it easier for me to celebrate mine <laughs> and with a new baby. So hopefully, you know, should be finishing her up um, close to around my birthday or even if it's mid way through April. Um, yeah, that's what I'm hoping for, but I'm not sure because she hasn't really given me like a delivery date or I, even a progress of where she's at with the baby. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, I'm going to keep buying for the baby because I got to prep. Oh, one of the things I wanted to, um, actually ask you guys is if, um, I know that certain, you guys certainly have a preference. I know that watching some of your channels, you have a preference of like the, um, 
different brands of diapers. And there's so many different brands out there, but I want to try some new brands. And I'm not sure what they are or if you guys like them or if you have any suggestions of the disposable diapers, not the cloth diapers. I have my favorites for cloth diapers, but I want to find um, some maybe more different kind of it's just the disposable diapers. I know that a lot of people like the Honest brand. Um, I know that some people like the Pampers newborn. Um, so if you want to throw any suggestions my way, I'm definitely looking to, I want to buy some, but I don't want to just buy a bunch of packs and not know if they're any good or if they fit our dolls well. So yeah, any suggestions would be great if you guys want to share them. <laughs> but anyways, here is Miss Lucy Grace. Looking perfectly precious in this outfit. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your Saturday. And we'll see you all soon. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.